American Leather was founded by an engineer 32 years ago. He was a consultant in another furniture manufacturer, and he saw the opportunity to bring furniture to the United States faster. 32 years ago, the only leather company that was kind of giving goods to the United States was Natuzzi out of Italy, and the lead time was 16, 22 weeks. So he saw an opportunity to build furniture in the United States in four weeks or less. My name is Veronica Schnitzius. I'm the president of American Leather. Have been with the company for 22 years. We are a furniture manufacturer in Dallas, Texas that has around 700 employees. American Leather's manufacturing process is what is called mass customization. We run around 400 pieces of furniture a day today. And every piece that is running through the factory right now is already for an end consumer or a store. We don't do any finished good, we don't manufacture anything for inventory, everything is custom made. I think one of the biggest challenges for us is we don't like just to buy equipment like everybody else. We want to buy equipment that we can customize and use the best for our process, not just what it comes out of standard. When we went out there looking for solutions, there's a lot of great solutions out there, but we would have to modify our production process to accommodate that solution. We are a big company, but not big enough to just kind of redesign a piece of equipment and software. And soon was open to at least listen to us and kind of like work with us into what we're utilizing today. American Leather's model has been about vertical integration because we believe in controlling our own destiny. So from the beginning, we had our own frame shop where we can cut our frames, we can build our frames, and we can manufacture the rest of the frames in-house. In 2017, we integrated the foam operation. So within the 350,000 square feet, we do frames, foam, pillows, cutting, everything. On the cutting side, with Zoom here, having the ability to nest, cut, and sew everything in one building has given us the ability to do things faster than many of our competitors. Our production process from release of the order in manufacturing to shipping is 3.5 days. Most companies that I know of in the United States is usually 10 days. Another thing that is important on the vertical integration is the ability to quick and pivot quickly. Fashion, trends, different things, or a customer demand. We have customers that are opening a store and they change their mind the day before the store has opened. We have done pieces of furniture in less than eight hours. If we didn't have equipment like Zoom in-house, we wouldn't be able to do that. The Swiss engineering is that attention to detail is something that I haven't found any other place in the world. We use something that is called the Italian sock method, which is like we sew the cover of a sofa or a chair like a tailor jacket. So if that tailor jacket is not to spec, it would never fit on the frame. Without that precision, a sewing is not right, a posture is not right, and then we don't have the right product. I don't think I, I have ever worried too much about one of the zones not running, right? So just that peace of mind knowing that the equipment is reliable, we have spare parts, we have great service, it is in the United States, it is a huge thing. The software part, also the mind software, every time we have a question, they're responding to us. I know probably we're not their easiest customers because we're very demanding, but I appreciate the patience and I hope that Zoom and Mine knows that I hope this is worth it for all of us. It has been worth it for us. I would recommend Zoom to other companies. The reason why is Zoom has been pretty much our only partnered in the leather cutting process that we have and a big part of the fabric cutting process that we have even today. So we believe in Zoom. We continue to invest in Zoom. Zoom is the only investment on cutting we have done probably in the last five years. We haven't gone with any other companies. The Zoom equipment is not necessarily inexpensive, but I do believe value and money is on the eyes of the beholder. But when we look at longevity, service, time and money, I believe is a great investment.